Well, we've got another pretty <laughs> active day. It was a nice dry start to our week, and now we're tracking another round of storms. So it's a Denver 7 weather action day here, just about 515. Uh, yesterday was bike to work day. If you're biking this morning, you're going to find some drizzle early on. We're in the 60s uh, across parts of northeastern Colorado near Greeley and Sterling, two of the spots where we most recently saw a few thunderstorms. Those are now clearing out, but you can see from this shot at Lookout Mountain how much cloud cover we have over the city this morning. And with those low lying clouds, you'll find a little sprinkle or two as you're driving in. Low to mid 60s early on. Temps are extremely comfortable. We're not going to see much of a warm up though today. In fact, we'll go from 60s, low 60s to about 10, 12 degrees warmer uh, for highs here this afternoon. Severe weather. Now, the green area, that's where we have a marginal risk of storms right through the metro area. Most of those really strong storms are going to develop north and east. East of Denver, closer to Sterling, Akron, Greeley, and then up into parts of Nebraska and then east into Kansas. So timing wise, take a look at what's going to happen here early on. We do have some clouds that will then, as you can see, clear up a bit within the next few hours. So a little bit more sunshine, a little bit more of a warm up, upper 60s to low 70s by about 12 o'clock, and then we'll see some mid to upper 70s for highs. That'll be brief though, between about two and three. Right around two o'clock, expect to see some darker skies, storms building, heavy pockets of rain, larger hail, gusty winds, and you can see again, we're north and east of Denver, closer to spots like Bennett, Keensburg, up toward Fort Morgan. We'll see some of these storms turn a little bit stronger. Another minor round, it looks like, just before sunset tonight, and then skies will clear out overnight. So timing is pretty typical for us in a, in a summer stormy afternoon kind of scenario. Early tomorrow morning, we're under a little mix of sun and clouds, and then we've got another round of storms tomorrow afternoon. It does look like the risk of severe weather will be a little bit lower for us on Friday, and then once that clears out, some warmer and drier weather is going to settle in. Your camping forecast this weekend, obviously the mountains are going to be a busy spot. Saturday and Sunday, we're expecting 70s. There will be a chance for a few thunderstorms each afternoon, but the overall pattern, not only in the mountains, but also here in town, is going to be drier with just a few late day storms. Today and tomorrow, though, a pretty cool end to June, which has been a pretty chilly month. We're going to take a closer look at that coming up a little bit later in the show. Low to mid 80s Saturday and Sunday, and then early next week as we're prepping for the fourth. Monday is going to be a warm one, expecting some pretty good pool weather there. A lot of folks will be off, obviously, on Monday and Tuesday. And then on Tuesday, again, a few afternoon storms, mid to upper 80s.